I'm Agent Parker. Hello, Parker. Hello. It's an honor to meet you. Everyone at the headquarters is talking about you. The idea of posing as a ship's captain and sailor was brilliant. What else should we have done? Told K2 who we really were? No, of course not. Thanks to your clothes, we were able to track you down. It seems like everyone is after our clothes. Lightweight, bulletproof, and traceable by CIA satellites in every corner of the world. Of course. You wouldn't want to own clothes like this. Oh. Sorry it took us so long to find you guys. Speaking of which, when you write your report, could you please not mention that it took us so long? Um... Yes, sure. No problem. Gentlemen, a congratulatory message from the boss. Just the ride. Very good. Did you manage to decode it, Lieutenant Benninger? Well, we just changed a few letters. Excellent. The boss can't wait to meet you. Captain, Agents Anderson and Smith. Thanks, Parker. A man in Havana got caught. Pity, what a pity. He was an excellent man. Who would have imagined that behind these lousy, smelly vagabonds were two of our best agents? You just foiled K2's plan and are already working on the banana smuggling case? Well, it was just luck. And we hope it lasts too. Now you can finally shave your beard, Agent Anderson. We still have a lot to talk about, but first we'll visit our new training camp. It will be an honor for us if you would try it. Is my blood. Oh. My name is Dr. Brown. You can call me Doc. Hi, Doc. I would give a lot to be like you. Was the training hard? Hmm. Follow me. I can't wait to show you our new gimmicks. This is the firearms department. But agents of your caliber don't require such weapons. Gentlemen, for our best agents, we have the latest generation of drugs available. Pills for increasing stamina and regenerating health. Pills for invisibility and superpowers. We have one that allows you to see through walls, and another that makes you jump higher. Then we have one that makes you really rubbery, so that people can jump on you. Then we have one hey. that makes you really <laughs> stiff. So hey, that what no do you want? You. 
Ooh, Did you hear that? One that also yes, makes I heard. Really I don't need Just headache pills. After a night of drinking, the only thing that helps the headache is a few beers more. What? No, I, I mean the invisibility pills. Huh? If we can get them, we could get out of here straight away. Uh, but which ones are they among all of these? Um, okay, all right, let's see. Uh, da, da. Aha, there they are. Invisible. Take one. And then we have pills for flatulence. And my favorite, the CX-32. It will make you a master tailor. Ah, I see you're in a hurry. You've already taken the satellite tracking pills. <sighs> no, Doc, you're wrong. It was the invisible pills. Exactly. Invisible. In stands for in your bloodstream for 25 years, and visible because our satellites can locate you anywhere in the world. And the best part is that if the enemy tries to take the tracker out of you, it will explode. This way you avoid being tortured and interrogated. <laughs> Did you hear that, Agent Anderson? Anywhere in the world. Isn't that wonderful? I'll show you what I think about it. Invisibility test number 217 starts in 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Um, yes, we still have to work on the invisibility. But don't worry, your trackers are 90% functional. If you could, please avoid mentioning the explosion in your report. What do you think, big man? Can we? Yes, okay. Thanks, Doc. If you guys are done here, I will take the agents with me. Certainly. Gentlemen, it was my pleasure. Oh, sorry. What was that? Don't worry. That sometimes happens with the flatulence pills. Follow me. Before you get back to work, how about teaching our recruits some fighting techniques. It's not often we have two super agents visiting us. Oh, we're not actually that good. Don't be so humble, Agent Smith. I've read your record. Tenth Dan, Black Belt Karate and Judo, and an excellent flamenco dancer. However, Agent Anderson, a little physical activity wouldn't hurt, don't you think? And didn't I tell you to shave? Not yet. Then I'll say it now. Yes, sir. No, no, he told you. I, I was there. Off to the gym, guys.
What happened here? Anderson, is this your work? They're just kids, for goodness sake. Um, you know how it is, don't you? One slap followed the other. We got into it. Very well done, Smith. You suckers, off to the shower. There is news. It seems that there is a connection between illegal betting and the yellow gold trade. Ha! But we don't know much about it yet. Your fake identities have already been created. From now on, you are police agents. Yes, sir. Captain Jones will be waiting for you in Chinatown with further instructions. Agent Smith, you're number one and you're in charge. <laughs> yeah, of course. Um, could you, if you could not mention in your report how my cadets lost the combat exercise to you?